Hi guys, in this video I'm going to talk about how I get my clips and my footage for videos when I use a TV show or a movie. And I do this in multiple steps, so I made a notepad of it. The first step is actually downloading a TV show or a movie. And I personally get all my shows or movies with torrents because I find them very easy to use and I can find basically everything uh, on torrent sites. And I actually download from a Russian torrent site sometimes because they always have TV shows in HD. After I get all my episodes and seasons or just the movie, I make a list of the scenes in an episode. For example, if I make a video about a couple, I go through each episode and then uh, write up the times of their scenes. So write up the starting time of one of their scenes and then write down the ending time of their scenes. This comes handy in the first step, which is converting. If I download my uh, TV shows and movies in HD, which I lately try to do, HD files are most of the time MKV files, which is basically the only file that Vegas won't open, so it's a pain in the ass, but that's what converting is for. And when it comes to converting, the second step is uh, very helpful for me. And after I have all my scenes converted, I cut them up in Sony Vegas, so I cut them up into little pieces so it will be easier to use in the future. Alright, so first of all, I'm not going to talk about the first step uh, too much because I think all of you can download your uh, TV shows or movies, but I'm going to talk about the second step, which is making the list. I'm going to open this uh, video and I use BS Player, but you can use anything you want. And since it has got a Russian audio, I don't want that <laughs> because I can't speak Russian. And I'm going to select the English one. All right. So I'm going to click play. And then with my arrows on my keyboard, I'm going to click the right arrow. And with this, I can see when when a scene uh, starts and when it stops. And this uh, in this case, I'm going to look for scenes with Alex and Michael. And this is the show Nikita, which everyone should watch because it's so underrated and it's such an amazing show and I love it. So I'm going to look for scenes with them and I see that it starts around 2 minutes and 18 seconds and because the converting program can sometimes cut off the first 2 or 3 seconds I always add or extract 2 or 3 seconds so if it starts at 2 minutes 18 seconds I'm going to write 2 minutes 16 and now I'm going to again press play and press my uh, right arrow until I find the end of this scene which is around uh, 4 minutes and 44, so I'm going to add 4 minutes and 46. Then press enter and then look for their next scene. A new scene around oops, this time and I'm going to look where it ends. And sometimes I leave in little scenes in between because if it's only 20 seconds, I'm not going to make two different uh, videos about the same scene. So I'm going to just wait until then. So 10, 37. And I go through all the episodes and write down the times and then I go through all of the episodes and I'm going to show you how a full list looks like. So it looks like this. So you can see that it's episode one, episode two, episode three. And I write and I wrote up all the uh, timings for the different scenes. And you also need to change the points to, I don't know how you call these double points in English. My English can be so freaking bad sometimes. I actually have no idea how you call this. But then I click on to replace all of the points to this because the com my converting program is going to need these points and not the simple points. So the dub 
what the hell is the name of these points? Anyways, so after I wrote up all my uh, times, I go into my converter program and I actually uploaded the setup file or exe file of this converter because I like it very much and it's not the latest version of this program, but I don't really like the newest one, but you can get that one too. It's basically the same thing. You can find the download link in the description box. So after you open the program, I'm going to just show you which are my settings for converting. So first of all, I select, oh, I'm sorry that this is in, the program is in Hungarian, um, but hopefully you can still uh, follow what I do. So I'm going to uh, select uh, video files and then select the AVI option right here and then scroll down. The video codec is XWID and that's good for me, but I want to change the uh, video size to the original one if I want to keep the original sizes. And then I go to the video bitrate and then select. I usually select either 8000 or 10,000. I'm going to select 10,000 now, but the higher you select, the, the better the quality will be but the bigger the file size will also be, of course. And then I go to the frame size or frame rate, and then I either cl uh, click auto or I click um, uh, 30 or this one. And then I go down to MP3 and I change this to 192. And I'm going to drag in this episode that I showed you. And I'm going to drag this in twice because I wrote up two different scenes but if you uh, write up five different scenes in an episode then you are going to drag this in five different times. Alright, so let's click on the first one. Go up to the starting time and the stopping time. Highlight uh, this one, the starting uh, time, copy it, click right here, press uh, Ctrl V and it's going to paste uh, the time into Again, highlight this one, Ctrl C, click right here, Ctrl V. And you will see that uh, instead of the full time, it will tell you that it's two minutes and 30 seconds long, which is the scene. Go to the next one, highlight the first time, Ctrl C, Ctrl V, Ctrl C, and then Ctrl V. All right. So we have our two scenes, but since my video has two uh, audios, I'm going to scroll down right here. And when it says audio um, track, maybe, I'm going to click on it and select the English one. And I'm going to do that to this one too. And then I'm going to click on convert. And after it's finished, it will give you a window about it. And I think it will also open the folder where um, your videos have being converted into. And I'm going to show you quickly uh, how my files look like. So I have my Michael and Alex uh, scenes and I have season one, season two and season three. If I go into season one, you will see that I have cut out and converted this many scenes. So uh, 48 in this season. And I do this because first of all, Vegas can't uh, import MKV files, but second of all, if I were to uh, import all of my episodes into Sony Vegas, it would work even slower than it already does. And it's also good because, as I said, my memory is for shit, so it can really help me when I can see the thumbnails of the different scenes and I know what to look for. And as I said, the last step was uh, cutting up the scenes uh, in Sony Vegas and I'm going to show you what I mean by that in a second. I pull in the scene and then go through the uh, video and whenever a new camera angle comes in, like right here, I press uh, S on the keyboard so it's going to split the video in two and then do this with the whole scene and then I either delete all the clips that I know that I won't use in the future or I just leave them as it is and when I want to make a video about them in the future I can just uh, click on the clips I like like this and then click on this one while uh, holding down the control arrow then this one and this one right click copy make a new project file 
with my uh, video in mind that I want to edit to and that I need these clips for and then I press Ctrl V and I have all these clips right here and I know that these are all from one, uh, one camera angle so for me it just it's just so easy to if I cut this uh, cut the scenes up before actually editing um, and getting my footage converted downloaded and then cut up is the most hated thing by me because it just takes so much time and I just really 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 don't like it but the steps that I showed you make this um, a little easier for me but I'm not sure if it actually helped any of you I just wanted to show you guys how I do this and maybe show you a good video converter keep in mind that when you convert a video from MKV HD you are not uh, going to get the same quality after the converting is done anyways I hope some of you guys could enjoy this video and find something that could be uh, helpful and if you have any requests about tutorials please 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 tell me about them in the comment section below and uh, see you guys soon bye